Scripture Basics Part 24. Today's installment is John chapter 3, verse 7, God's mandate to man. We are spiritual beings living in a physical world that have spiritual needs. The word of God is the only place to deal correctly with our spiritual needs. Keep sharp sword with the word of God sharp in your life. John chapter 3, verse 7, King James Version. Marvel not that I said unto thee, ye must be born again. The New Living Translation, so don't be surprised when I say, you must be born again. The Message Version, so don't be surprised when I tell you that you have to be born from above, out of this world, so to speak. You know well enough how the wind blows this way and that. You hear it's rustling through the trees but you have no idea where it comes from or where it's headed next. That's the way it is with everyone born from above, by the wind of, of God, the spirit of God. This verse is telling us, first off, ye, which is plural, not just Nicodemus, but all mankind must be born again or anew from above. Jesus' statement to Nicodemus that evening has been heralded to all the world ever since. Both Jew and Gentile have heard the divine mandate, you must be born again. Without the new birth, one cannot see or enter into the kingdom of God. In those words, millions have heard Jesus speaking directly to their hearts. Behind Jesus' challenge is his invitation to each of us. You must be born again. Allow him to do that for you. We've come to the end of this installment. For this and other scripture teaching, check out youtube.com channel Minister Herbert Pankey. If you like the material, please hit the subscribe button for the channel. Remember, keep that sword sharp. Thanks and God bless.